Hello everyone, welcome back to another Adobe Photoshop 2020 tutorial, guys. This one, I'm going to show you how to delete a person, just remove a person out of a photo in like 90 seconds or less. It doesn't necessarily mean it will be done perfectly, but I'm going to show you the techniques so that you guys can go in and uh, do that. And I'll also show you some ways to refine it at the end of the video here. So you'll see here I've got a, a picture of a guy taking a picture, uh, strangely enough, Inception, um, of the outdoors. And let's just say I want to get rid of him because this is a tutorial and that's what I'm teaching. All right, so I've got the picture here. This is a free picture from Pexels, by the way, guys. It's So if you want to follow along, just download any old picture and work with me. The first step here is you want to make sure you're clicked on the layer. Now you want to go over to the top left and you want to select the lasso tool. We are going to draw a very generous size uh, selection around this guy here. Uh, something like that. Let's go with something like that. Okay, uh, yeah. And I'm going to add, I'm going to hold the shift key down and I'm going to add that to it. So you'll see the plus sign. So I've made this my selection just in case you didn't know what I was doing there. Now the next step is in Photoshop 2020, you want to go up to edit and you want to go to content aware fill. When you do that, you will see right away that that guy is gone. He's history. I, he's been deleted. This, in most cases, is probably all you need to do. Let's go ahead and hit OK. And boom, he's history. Now, I'm going to hit Select, Deselect. And you'll notice here that he's gone. And to be honest, it's done a pretty good job of it. Um, there are. You'll notice here that the rock is gone. So when I, I turn the layer off, this was the original layer. This is the modified layer, so that's about the only thing you can see here. And if you look really, really closely, these don't look quite as natural as some of these other areas, but you'd have to be a really good, you'd have a hell of an eye to do something like that to see that. So uh, if that's all you needed to do, guys, that might be it. You can turn the tu tutorial off now. Um, I'm going to go ahead and delete that layer. What the hell? We're going to do it again, but this time I'm going to show you how to maybe keep the rock in, the, in it. So in case we just want to remove him but we don't want to do the rock kind of thing. <laughs> oh man, I'm not saying anything wrestling related here. So again, I'm going to draw another selection around him. Not quite as loose this time, but this time I'm going to go in on his feet like this and then something like that, okay? And now I'm going to go back up, edit content to wear fill. And when you do this, you're going to see here, this is what it's revised looks like. And it looks pretty good. However, it's not perfect because the rock, if you go really tight in on it, uh, let's see here. It just looks like there's like those where his shoes are. They're, they just don't look 100% right. And you can probably see that. So uh, I'm just going to zoom back out a little bit. Um, what you want to do is, well, here's what I'm going to do. The part that I'm going to replace him with is not going to have this Brock stuff in it. So I'm going to delete this out. So you'll see here that at the top here, you've got a selection tool, plus and minus. So you can actually select what you will be using uh, to replace him with. So if I want him to be replaced with mainly just this, this, the ground here and the trees, but not the rocks, I can delete out the parts I don't want. So here we go. I'm deleting out this rock here. I'm going to delete out this bit here. I don't think this is going to add anything to it. So I'm going to delete out that rock and maybe a little bit of this here, just, just to be safe. Cause yeah, and this white stuff here too, I don't think it's quite right. So there we go. This is the parts that I've deleted. Now it updates automatically and you'll see here it's made a slight change, but the rock is intact. So I'm going to hit OK. And then you're going to see here that, OK, the guy is still history, but the rock is there. So that is one way to do that. So there's the fast way and then there's the way where you can paint in like I just did there. But basically the the areas that I want content to wear filled to use, guys. So if you're looking for a 60 second solution or a four or five minute solution, depending on how detailed you need to be, that is really all there is to it, guys. I'm going to hit select, deselect, and boom, there he's gone. He's in the frame. He's out of the frame. It looks pretty damn convincing. And uh, that's it, guys. So thanks for watching the tutorial. A lot more stuff coming up. Stay tuned.